Ayer tuve el agrado de poder platicar con una de las personalidades más grandes en el mundo de los negocios y la tecnología sobre los temas a tomar, sobre todo en los riesgos para crecer, México y sus inversiones, la industria musical y los viajes turísticos al espacio. Por supuesto, nos referimos a Sir Richard Branson, quien concedió una entrevista exclusiva a Excelsior Televisión y esto fue lo que nos comentó. Uh, my first question is, Mr. Branson, uh, how is changing uh, the business world today? Uh, you are a successful man uh, without fear of risk. Uh, sorry, if you don't take some risk, you don't make anything. Um, so you, you, do, you definitely need to take yes. some risk. Um, but I think it's, it needs to be a, a calculated risk. Um, and obviously because uh, Virgin is a, a well-known brand around the world, um, it's easy for us, easier for us to take risk than, than some smaller companies that don't have such a strong brand. Many companies in the world uh, fear of the risk. Is, uh, is this theme, is this topic, the risk, uh, one opportunity in the business? Yes, because I think many people um, Uh, yeah, m m many, m I mean, many people, including you know, some people you know within my own company, are are, are afraid of you know yes. afraid of taking risks. And, and, and in the end, you, if you're a good leader, you just need to sometimes say, I have a phrase, screw it, let's let, let, just do it. And uh, you know, you, you just need to say, let's let, let's just try something. And um, you know, for instance, when you know we decided to set up uh, a, a mobile phone business throughout South America. Um, a lot of people said, well, look, you've already got these enormous, wealthy, you know, people in, in South America. Why set up a mobile phone business if they're going to crush you? Yes. Um, but our attitude was, you know, if you can go for really good quality and good value and great staff, that you, that you should be able to succeed. And I have to convince uh, for you open one business in anywhere of the world, uh, for example, Mexico. Mexico... Uh, Uh, it, it, it has the mobile phone businesses, but they're very big and they maybe are not as customer focused yes. and customer friendly as they should be. So we decided to set up Virgin Mobile in Mexico. Um, Mexico has the most incredible future. Um, uh, I think it has a bigger future than Brazil, a bigger future than Colombia. Um, you know, it's going to be one of the, you know, if it's, if it's run well, it can be one of the greatest countries in, in, in the world. And, Um, and so we want to be here at, at the birth of the, the New Mexico. Yes. In, in what business uh, have you wanted uh, to invest, but uh, for the moment not yet? <laughs> um, I think if we wanted to invest, we would have invested. So, um, but uh, as far as Mexico is concerned, we are looking at uh, radio um, and we are looking at financial service as, as a possibility. But, um, but, um, but I think you know, Virgin's an unusual brand. We're involved in maybe 200 different businesses, and and, and so we've learned to, le learned a lot about. Um, life and and, um, and and where we see opportunities in other countries will 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 move in there how do you see now the uh, music industry uh, is really one business today uh, maybe internet is now this platform for the music uh, how see uh, for the music now i remember a uh, virgin record for example mm. now mm. um Well, we, we built uh, the largest independent record company in the world. We had great, great bands, Rolling Stones, you know, um, Genesis, Bill Collins, Sex Pistols, yeah. uh, and so on. Um, and um, uh, but the industry, uh, uh, you know, we sold that company, and the industry has, did, you know, not done very well since. I mean, live music is still wonderful. Live music will last forever. Um, but um, because of the internet. Uh, and because of Apple, um, it's much more difficult, I think, to make money for, for musicians today than it used to be. The rock changed your life, no? No, well, rock changes changed most people's lives, I think, of my generation. We, we were very lucky, I think, the generation we, we were in. What do you think and now of the rock, of the bands of rock? There are lots of wonderful bands, just like there used to be wonderful bands, you know, in the 60s and 70s. Um, it's just much more difficult for them today, um, because people expect their music for free. They don't expect to pay for it. Exists now one uh, date of the Virgin Galactic? 
Yeah, is you ready? Is this is really the Virgin Galactic? Um, Virgin Galactic uh, will will go to space in. Um, uh, well, I'll go to space in most likely the end of February or early March next year. Um, so we're very very close now, um, and um, and that will start a whole new age of space travel. Um, we have, I think, maybe six or seven people here in Mexico signed up to go to space with us, and. Um, and you know, we hope one day to get the price down so that you know thousands of people are watching this program. One day, will have a chance to go to space. Yes. Finally, Mr. Branson, uh, what will be uh, your next crazy in the world of the business? Um, I don't know. I mean, obviously, uh, here in Mexico, we just want to make sure that Virgin Mobile becomes a great success, and, and it, it's only just started, but it's looking very good. Um, and then on the back of that, I think Virgin, the Virgin brand will do many things in Mexico. Um, uh, you know, I've just had the most wonderful welcome from our yes. staff, and um, I, if I can have that kind of welcome every time I come to Mexico, we'll, 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 we'll be doing we'll, launching a business every day. Finally, is you. Uh, what is your thing now with the poetry? You write poetry. Uh, I, I write. I, I don't write very good poetry, um, but I like to. I like to make poetry through the things I create. Bueno, parte de lo que nos comentó el señor Richard Branson en esta en esta entrevista exclusiva que ofreció a Excelsior Televisión. Te invitamos a seguir cuestionando la información con los siguientes videos.